We're in Windows 10. I'm going to show you how to add a network printer. Let's start by opening up the control panel. And we're going to go right to devices and printers. From here, we're going to click on add a printer. So it's looking on the network for a printer. It's also looking locally if it has a USB connected printer as well. And when it finds what it's looking for, you can go ahead and install it. Now, if it finds the printer you're looking for, then it's as simple as highlighting the printer and clicking next until it's finished. But sometimes it doesn't find the printer you want. So let's just go ahead and click on the My Printer. It wasn't listed. All right, so what we need to do is to um, get the printer's IP address off of the printer itself by printing a status page. It'll tell you what IP address it is, and then you can go ahead and click the uh, Add using a TCP IP address. All right, so we're going to let it auto-detect, and we're going to put in the IP address of the printer. Tell it to query the printer. And it found that it's an HP 6500. Go ahead and click Next. It's going to install the print drive. It says you've successfully added it. Now you go ahead and click Finish. Now, if it did not find the printer, then you can download the print drivers from uh, HP or whatever it is just by going to their website, hp.com slash support, something like that. And then you can download the printers, save them to a spot on your computer, and then you can choose the drivers when you get prompted at that point. But for the most part, most printers are going to be automatically detected and they're going to uh, install automatically.